Good morning, folks. Very exciting day today. Uh, we've got the Cap City Youth Muskie Tournament this uh, today, and um, a lot of kids. Holy cow! Fifty-two kids are going to be competing out here on the Madison Chain of Lakes yep. to catch uh, the biggest muskie. Yep, yep. That is pretty awesome. There's like half the kids um, haven't even caught a muskie, and they're in yeah. this fishing tournament for muskies. So that's just so cool. cool. So cool. Uh, uh, it's, yeah. cl it's clear water right now. It's uh, the cooler than than normal water, and they're gonna see some muskies yeah, today. Yeah, yeah. No hope doubt. so. Hope so. Hope, hopefully they're moving with this warm weather. I, I would imagine they should be. Um, but yeah, no, it's gonna be exciting. Hopefully uh, we can, I don't know, capture some kids with their first muskies. <laughs> Man, I, this is pretty much where I got going musky fishing on the chain here. I've seen this chain grow from its infancy of a fishery, and now there's some big ones in here. Yep. So let's go check it out. Boys are hooked up with something. What do we got? What do we got? Little pike. Ah. Little pike. <laughs> Little pike. Hey. Well, pike are counting in this tournament because you can never count on muskies to bite. So we'll, let's go get a look see at this. All right, we are in the boat with Joe Spildy, who has got a pike. We actually watched them catch it. It is 20 and a half. 20 and a half inch pike. Joe, let's hear. What would you catch it on? Here's your fish. Um, I caught it on a, a black rabbit. Rabbit squirrel. Rabbit, rabbit squirrel. squirrel bucktail. Yep. All right. Black and silver. Uh, yeah. I saw the I saw the bait. I saw the bait. You can't you can't tell a lie now. All right. Awesome. Have you seen any muskies yet this morning? Um, no, I have not. Okay. Well, they just haven't woke up yet, right? That's right. Cool. Well, you want to throw them back in, Joe? Yeah. Yeah, throw them back in. Right in the water. <laughs> awesome. All right, guys, that's a start to the morning. At least get a little slime in the boat. Um, next one's going to be a muskie, right? Yep. Okay. All right, we'll get out of your way and let you do your work. Hey, hey, hey. What do we got? We got 27. 27? All right, that might be top. All right, 27 right on the head. All right, hold that up. Awesome, good work. Whew. What did that eat? It ate the um, some the double eights. Spanky double eights. Yeah. Double eights, right on. That's a nice pike. What's the hot color? The green and black. Green right. and black. Awesome. All right. Awesome. 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 Good job. <laughs> Okay, we're in the boat here with Cal. Cal, I understand you're on the board at least with a fish? Yep. Okay, and what, what did you end up catching? A pike. A pike. No muskies yet? No. How big was your pike? Um, 24 inches. 24 inches, all right. And what was that on? <laughs> what's the bait? Um, Maybe the same bait you're throwing now? Yeah. Are you gonna uh, tell us the secret? A Lee Lures um, Boiler Maker. All right. <laughs> Looks like some nice weeds you're fishing in here. Did you have any other action that may have been a muskie? <laughs> right away this morning, something happened? Yeah. Um, just, I didn't feel much and I set the hook and after that, nothing was on. Just real quick, on and nothing after that. Yeah. Gotcha. Well, there, there's still time to get it done. Um, I think, I don't know if someone's got a bigger pike or not. I've heard rumors of it, but I'm not really sure what's up, to be honest. All right, folks, so there you have it. The time is 1230. We still have an hour and a half. I know last year there was fish within the last hour. So uh, you never know. Keep that bait wet, buddy. And uh, we'll uh, come back around when you catch that fish. All right, folks, we're in the boat with Forrest Waddell. Forrest had the second, second place fish uh, last year, and that was how big, Forrest? 38. All right, and that was on what bait? 
Uh, that was on the TNA Angry Dragon like I'm throwing right now, but uh, walleye color. Right on, cool, cool. Uh, what's the word today for you, Forrest? Well, we started out right away with uh, 18 inch, so a small pike, and then uh, probably two or three hours later, we had a 30 inch um, pike, which, and we saw. Follow or bite? We had to have the bite, so we had them in the boat. Oh, got it, okay, okay. cool. All and right. then we saw one, when we were over there, we saw one, like, sunbathing. Sun tanning muskies, yes. common theme this spring. <laughs> and then we saw, I want to say it was really skinny, like I could see it clearly, it was really skinny, but um, probably 32, so small muskie. Sure, okay. Well, we've got just under an hour left yes. and they have not really bit yet, so we definitely still got some time. Hopefully this last hour is gonna be a banger. Oh yeah, here. hopefully it's on fire for everyone. That's what I'm hoping for. I want to see some musky this year. All right, Forrest, good luck, buddy. We appreciate uh, the update, man. Thank you. Well, unfortunately, we did not get the call of a musky in the net. Uh, no musky, all pike. All pike. Yeah, so. Sounds like a fair amount of pike yeah. action. Not sure who's gonna win though. We were not called over for the for the winner for, the biggest for, for the biggest pike. So I don't know, we don't know. So, um, but yeah, a lot of pike were caught today. Um, that just goes to show 52 anglers out here chucking baits and not one musky caught. It, it's just unbelievable. <laughs> they really are the most frustrating fish in the, in the planet. How can you have 52 baits in the water for eight hours and not catch a muskie? No. And there's a lot of small fish in here. A lot of big fish, a lot of small fish. One of the, one of the best action yeah. lakes in the, in, the, in the state. Oh yeah. <laughs> it's like, yeah. So Robbie, let's just say that uh, it's not just us that's on the struggle bus right yeah, now. Yeah, it's a lot of people, so I don't know. Well, let's head into the weigh-in, folks, and see how guys fared, any yeah. big fish lost, and yep. you know, see what happened. See if there was a follow today. <laughs> Jeepers, well, I know there was some follows. Yeah, so. Um, but, and we'll grab some lunch, too, with everybody, so we'll see what's up uh, right about now. So our third place winner tonight with a northern of 30 inches was Forrest Waddell. Forrest. Nice work, buddy. Thank you. you. There we go. Good job. Forrest is going to tell us what happened. Uh, so we all kind of had a rough day today. Um, no muskies were caught, but we just kept casting all day long. We got our favorite spot. So still on the shoreline, uh, we got a 30 inch um, northern and in the same spot we also saw probably same size musky follow in, which was pretty cool. Congratulations. Our second place finisher today with a northern of 30 inches and three quarters is Ishan Soin. Ishan. So we were fishing, I guess, all day in a forest. I caught nothing except for the last five minutes where I got it was completely murky, and all of a sudden my line went tight and I got tight. Last five minutes. Yeah, nice. That's awesome. <laughs> Our first place winner of the Capital Cities Muskies Inc. Northern Pike Shootout with a fish of 33 and an eighth inches, Alex Larson. Alex. All right, let's hear the scoop. What happened? So what happened was uh, I think the first man of the. Uh, we went over to the train tracks over there, and I caught my uh, pike on a brown with yellow uh, bucktail, and I caught my first three casts of the day. So, wow. <laughs> awesome, wow. Oh. There you go. Wow. 
Congratulations. Nice job, man. Definitely no stranger to tough fishing. Uh, Robbie and I have also been on the struggle, struggle bus as of late. Um, I have not caught a muskie in about six weeks. So, and I've definitely been out there casting a couple times. So it, it just, it goes to show, you just gotta keep pounding. Like you said, the last five minutes, boom, it can happen just like that. So just don't get discouraged. The fish are still in the lake. The next time you get out could be the best day of your life. I know the best day we ever had here in Madison last summer, we didn't even get out till 10, 10.30 in the morning, ended up boating 12 fish in one day. So, I mean, who would have thought that was the day that would be the best day ever. But uh, really huge thanks to everybody involved that has made this one of the greatest fisheries in the state. Uh, couldn't be more proud of the work everyone's done. Uh, thank you, Michael Winther, for starting this out. This is just unbelievable what, uh, to see that many kids uh, slinging for muskies. I wasn't slinging for muskies at your guys' age, so uh, you, you guys are, got a way jump start on me. So, uh, huge round of applause. Thank you very much, everyone.